The twin towers were designed by architect Minoru Yamasaki as framed tube structures, which provided tenants with open floor plans, uninterrupted by columns or walls. Construction of the North Tower at One World Trade Center began in 1966 with the South Tower at Two World Trade Center, when completed in 1972. The South Tower became the second tallest building in the world at 1,362 feet for 115 meters. Its rooftop observation deck was 1,362 feet 415 meters high, and its indoor observation deck was 1,310 feet 400 meters high. Each tower stood over 1,350 feet 410 meters high and occupied about one acre 4,000 square meters of the total 16 acres 65,000 square meters of the site's land. During the early morning hours of August 7, 1974, French high-wire artist Philippe Petit took his position at 1,350 feet above ground in the South Tower. High above the streets of New York, Petty began the 131 feet walk between the Twin Towers with no net. 27 years later, American Airlines Flight 11, a Boeing 767 carrying 76 passengers excluding the hijackers and 11 crew members, departs 14 minutes late from Logan International Airport in Boston, bound for Los Angeles International Airport. Five hijackers are on board. Hijacker and ringleader Mohammed Adda will pilot the plane into the North Tower of the World Trade Center. Flight 11 crashed into the north face of the North Tower between floors 93 and 99. All passengers aboard are instantly killed with an unknown number inside the building. The crash caused it to collapse after burning for one hour and 42 minutes. United Airlines Flight 175 a Boeing 767, carrying 56 passengers excluding the hijackers and nine crew members, departs 14 minutes late from Logan International Airport in Boston, bound for Los Angeles International Airport. Five hijackers are on board. Lead hijacker pilot Marwan al Shehi will pilot the plane into the South Tower of the World Trade Center. It collapsed after burning for 56 minutes. American Airlines Flight 77, a Boeing 757, with 58 passengers excluding the hijackers and six crew members, departs 10 minutes late from Washington Dulles International Airport for Los Angeles International Airport. Five hijackers are on board. Lead hijacker pilot Henny Hanjur will pilot the plane into the west side of the Pentagon. All 59 passengers and crew are killed aboard the aircraft, including an additional 125, including emergency workers on the ground. The crash starts a violent fire. All five stories of the Pentagon on the west side, where American 77 crashed collapsed due to the fire started by the crash. United Airlines Flight 93, a Boeing 757, with 37 passengers excluding the hijackers and seven crew members, departs 42 minutes late from Newark International Airport, now Newark Liberty International Airport, bound for San Francisco International Airport. Four hijackers are on board. Lead hijacker pilot is Zia Jera. The plane is hijacked above northern Ohio. Turning to the southeast, Flight 93 is crashed by its hijackers as a result of fighting in the cockpit 80 miles 129 kilometers southeast of Pittsburgh in Somerset County, Pennsylvania. Later reports indicate that passengers had learned about the World Trade Center and Pentagon crashes and were resisting the hijackers. Seven World Trade Center, a 47-story building, collapses after fires started inside the building. The hijackings, crashes, fires, and subsequent collapses killed an initial total of 2,760 people. Toxic powder from the demolished high-rises was dispersed throughout the city and gave rise to numerous long-term health effects that continue to plague many who were in the tower's vicinity, with at least three additional deaths reported. 
The one one story towers are the tallest freestanding structures ever to be destroyed, and the death toll from the attack on the North Tower represents the deadliest terrorist act in world history.